rabbits. <laughs> oh, hey folks, it's Greg from Greg's Country Cabin Outdoors. Hope you're having a great day. Uh, I went into the local farm and home supply where I normally get my deer hunting tags a couple days ago and I found out that there were no shotgun tags available. They were sold out in a matter of three hours. And so I checked into another bow tag. I was able to get another bow tag. I personally prefer to get three deer each year. I don't always. Sometimes I only get two. Sometimes I only get one. But that's how much meat I need in my freezer to sustain our family for an entire year on venison. Um, I have been a hunter since I was 10 years old. I've hunted pheasant, rabbit, squirrel, and deer. I uh, grew up on a farm where we grew our own vegetables, canned them, frozen whatever, butchered our own hogs. Uh, we had cattle we took into the local locker service and had them butchered. Uh, I'm a meat eater. I've always been a meat eater. I'll always be a meat eater. So uh, it was rather disturbing when I found out or heard through the grapevine that PETA had come in and bought up most of the tags for the three counties that I hunt. I don't know what PETA thinks they're doing by buying up deer tags to prevent hunters from putting meat on the table. The hunters that don't take the meat home donate it to the locker service to donate to the poor, the hungry. That meat feeds people. Now, by harvesting the deer the way we do, we thin out the deer crop. And thinning out the deer crop makes it safe for you PETA people to drive down the interstate at 80 miles an hour so that you can get to the next destination to make sure that all the tags are bought up. Think about that the next time you or one of your loved ones is eating glass from your windshield because you hit a deer because you didn't allow a hunter to go out and fill his freezer. I've been a hunter for many years. I don't do it just for sport. I do it to feed my family, to put food on my table. Sport hunters, that's a different program. But most of the people that you bought the tags up for are not sport hunters. They're buying, or buying tags so that they can put meat on their tables. Think about it. Next time you're eating glass from your windshield because a deer came through because you bought up all the tags. This is Greg from Greg's Country Cabin. I'm done with my rant. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel.